For months, it was silent. The most distant human-made object in history, Voyager 1, was drifting alone in the abyss, sending back nothing but gibberish. After 47 years of groundbreaking exploration, it seemed the journey had finally come to an end until now. Suddenly, the signal returned, coherent, clear, and the data it brought with it has scientists intrigued. A respected physicist has issued a cautious statement. This could change our understanding. We may be looking at something unexpected. What has Voyager 1 found at the edge of interstellar space? And why are some experts suggesting that this may deepen our understanding of cosmic mysteries? Stay with us, because this isn't just a space mission. This could be a significant step into the unknown. Launched in 1977, Voyager 1 was built to last a few years, maybe a decade. Instead, it has survived 47 years in the harshest environment imaginable. It flew past Jupiter, past Saturn, and then was flung outward by gravity into deep space beyond the pull of the planets. But what made this mission possible wasn't just brilliant engineering. It was a cosmic coincidence that happens once every 176 years. The planets were perfectly aligned allowing engineers to slingshot Voyager from one world to another using gravity, conserving energy, and propelling it further and faster than ever imagined. They called it the Grand Tour, and it worked. Now, Voyager 1 is over 15 billion miles from Earth, traveling in a place where no human signal had ever reached before until Voyager sent one back. And what it just sent is challenging our scientific understanding. After months of corrupted data, something changed. Voyager 1 began transmitting readable information again. Only this time, the data was unusual. Scientists detected unexpected plasma fluctuations, shifts in magnetic fields, and a surge in particle density. But the most surprising part, these readings are not behaving like anything we've previously measured in interstellar space. One physicist said, it's like the spacecraft is no longer just outside the solar system. It's encountering something new. What's more, the orientation of cosmic rays, the direction of magnetic lines, they're all misaligned, as if Voyager 1 has entered a region that current models of interstellar physics cannot fully explain. It's as if the rules of reality are shifting. When Voyager 1 crossed the heliopause, the outer boundary of the sun's influence, it entered what scientists believed was empty interstellar space. But the data now shows that this region is anything but empty. Voyager is detecting turbulence, plasma waves, and charged particle storms that appear to have no consistent source. Additionally, there are minor trajectory deviations. The spacecraft seems to drift slightly, as if influenced by subtle forces we can't yet identify. It's not being pulled by stars. It's not hitting asteroids. So, what's causing this subtle but measurable motion? Some now propose Voyager has entered a transitional region, a liminal space between what we know and what lies beyond, a place where our laws of physics may require refinement. For years, most of the scientific community remained cautious. They studied, observed, and debated. But now, 
a respected physicist, has made a rare, thought-provoking statement. Voyager 1 is detecting patterns that challenge our current models of the universe. We may be seeing evidence of a complex region of space itself. He stopped short of speculative theories, but many are already wondering, could Voyager 1 be encountering an unexpected cosmic phenomenon? A unique interstellar medium, a boundary of uncharted space, or even a region we can't yet fully comprehend. Among the new data, scientists discovered a rhythmic fluctuation, a pulse coming from a region Voyager 1 recently passed through. This signal isn't natural background noise. It's structured, timed, and repeating. Initially, it was dismissed as interference or a fault in the instruments, but the pattern was consistent, matching no known stellar phenomenon. It wasn't from a pulsar, not a quasar, and not from any known source of radiation. Scientists are now investigating whether the pulse could be related to complex interstellar interactions, as it appears to vary slightly after Voyager's data bursts, suggesting dynamic environmental responses. One of the engineers working on decoding Voyager's latest transmissions made a curious observation. When visualizing the magnetic field variations as a three-dimensional model over time, a shape began to emerge. It wasn't random. It wasn't noise. It looked like a spiral framework repeated with near-perfect symmetry. Some now propose it may be a complex magnetic structure, a pattern beyond our current understanding. Others suggest it could be a natural phenomenon not yet cataloged in astrophysics. Either way, it has no precedent in our observations. And yet, Voyager 1 flew directly through it. Voyager 1's onboard systems have been acting erratically, but not in the way you'd expect from an aging spacecraft. Its internal orientation sensors have begun reporting inconsistent positions, as if the spacecraft is navigating complex spatial conditions. Even more intriguing, its signal has shown tiny but measurable variations in transmission timing, suggesting it may be passing through regions where space-time is subtly affected. This isn't just instrument decay. Some scientists are now exploring whether Voyager may have entered a region of unusual interstellar conditions, a concept theoretical physicists are beginning to investigate more seriously. Now it's real and Voyager is right in the middle of it. When Voyager was launched, it was never intended to leave the solar system. Its main mission was to observe the gas giants and then simply drift. But now, over four decades later, it's doing something far more profound, revealing new aspects of the universe itself. What started as a journey past the planets has become a voyage into uncharted cosmic phenomena. And here's the irony. The spacecraft that carries the golden record, the message from humanity to the cosmos, may be the first to encounter data that reshapes our understanding. Voyager 1 was never meant to go this far. It was launched with 1970s technology, powered by less computing power than a digital watch and aimed at planets we thought we understood. But now, 47 years later, it's sending back data that is prompting scientists to rethink our models of the universe. A pulse that behaves like a complex pattern, a shape hidden in magnetic data, spatial variations that suggest new phenomena and a journey that now seems less like an escape from our solar system 
and more like an encounter with uncharted regions, something beyond our current physics, something intriguing. The spacecraft, meant to be our ambassador to the stars, may have found new frontiers of knowledge. Or perhaps, something even more profound. So now we ask, is Voyager 1 still exploring space? Or is it revealing that space, as we thought we knew, it is far more complex? Let us know what you think in the comments. Has Voyager uncovered new dimensions of interstellar space? Or are we just beginning to see the first signs of a universe more intricate than we imagined? Subscribe and turn on notifications because the next transmission from Voyager could deepen our cosmic perspective.